What's going on football world? It's Carter with X's and O's and today I'm going to be talking about sandbacker dogs. Uh, as a quick review I want to discuss the difference between line stunts, dogs, and blitzes at least the way I learned it and the way I coached it up. Uh, but a line stunt is a gap exchange between defensive linemen. A dog is a gap exchange between a defensive lineman and a linebacker. And a blitz is a combination of gap exchanges between defensive linemen, linebackers, and or defensive backs. But today we're going to be talking about sandbacker dogs. As you can see, I have three pre-drawn offensive lines in X's and O's blue. And then on the defensive side of the ball, I have a basic 4-3 over front in which the defensive players who are involved in the dog or the gap exchanges are in X's and O's green. Let's first talk about the Q word or the alert word or the hot word that the coach will call in the huddle and the players will hear in the huddle and the hot word or the alert for a sandbacker dog will be an animal. There is always a rule breaker so let's talk about the rule breaker first and the rule breaker in my system is always the name of the player going up into his natural gap. In this 4-3 over front alignment Sam is pre-snap aligned in a 50 Three technique. If you have not watched my defensive gaps and defensive techniques video, please go back and do so. It'll make my um, subsequent videos easier to understand and it'll make more sense to you. But Sam is in a 53 technique and he is responsible pre snap alignment for the strong side C gap. And so the huddle call may be over Sam cover two. And on the snap of the ball, Sam is going to shoot his natural C gap. He's going to shoot his natural C gap. He is the only one in X's and O's green, therefore he is the only one going. There is no gap exchange. But he is still responsible for his strong side C gap as he goes through there. That is the only rule breaker. Moving down into the bottom left diagram, we see that the three technique and the sandbacker are now in X's and O's green. Three technique is sitting in a strong side B gap. Sam is pre-aligned in his 53 technique and is responsible for the strong side C gap. They are going to gap exchange. They are going to run the dog. Because it involves the B gap player and Sam is going to run into the B gap, we are going to call this one a Badger. Badger for B gap. The three technique is going to short stick across the face of the offensive tackle and work into Sam's C gap. He's going first. Sam is going to come around the three technique gap exchange, replace the three technique, and work into the strong side. work into the strong side B gap. B for Badger. The huddle call may be over Badger cover three something like that. Moving over into the bottom right diagram you see that the sandbacker and the nine technique are in X's and O's green therefore they will be running the gap exchange. The nine technique is naturally pre-snap aligned in the strong side D gap. Therefore, we're simply going to call this a dog. It's an animal and it begins with D. Therefore, Sam knows he's going on a dog into the D gap. The ninth technique is going to short stick inside, cross the face of the tight end, work up field into Sam's C gap, he's going first. Sam is going to come hard and tight 
behind the nine technique working to the D gap. He's coming around second and he is now responsible probably for contain, bootleg, all that good stuff. Oops. And he is now responsible for the nine techniques D gap. D for dog. So we have B, C, D. If you hear animal, it is a Sam backer dog. Or if you hear Sam, it is his natural gap dog, which is the C gap. I hope this video makes sense. I hope it simplifies your system. Whether you are a parent, coach, or player, I hope it um, enhances your knowledge of the game and makes it more enjoyable. As always, please like the YouTube video, subscribe to my channel, and if you would like to suggest uh, video topics or are interested in video topics that you think I may be able to share with you, please email me at xsandos.cs at gmail.com or uh, comment in the comment section of the video. This is Carter from X's and O's. I appreciate your time. We'll see you next time.